hi everyone welcome to or welcome back to another vlog so today you guys we're just spending time together we wanted to bring you guys along with us nothing planned just spending the day together so we want to bring you guys along with us but before we get into the video for those of you that are new click that subscribe button turn on your post notification bell so you will not miss any of our new uploaded videos and click the like button so you guys just come along with us and whatever we do i hope you guys enjoy Okay guys, as you can see, we're here at the car wash. Um, we just wanted to pick up the camera to bring you guys along with us just on a random day when we're sitting at home, not doing anything. I normally record my daughter and I running errands, going shopping, getting things for the house, me cleaning the house, cooking or whatever. But today, we really didn't have anything planned. And my husband said, get the camera and let's go riding. Let's spend the day together. So I'm hoping that you guys, and I'm sorry for the noise because he is washing the truck. He's getting some of the dirt and bugs off the car. And he, we don't normally take our car through the drive-through car wash. I know a lot of you guys do, but he says those things really damage the paint, scar it up, especially if you have those trucks where they go through, guys take their trucks through the car wash. And after they've gone mudding to get all of that dirt and stuff off the truck, he said all of those rocks and sand and stuff that be in, that be in the dirt, can get stuck into those little i guess little rags that they have that hits the car to clean them off it can damage the paint so we don't normally take our cars uh through those drive-through car washes so anyway if we don't hand wash our cars we're going to take them to this this type of car wash where you can just blow it off but anyway i don't want to continue to ramble on this is just a typical day in the life that i'm bringing you guys along with us on so i hope you enjoy the video <laughs> at Jack's because we were hungry. Jack's Old <laughs> South! This is our first time ever. This is our first time ever trying that food. So we both got, what was it called? Number one, big something. Yeah, it was some, but it was some burgers. But anyway, you guys, story time. So we were in there. Each time we go, okay, before, before I say this, but each time we go out to place an order somewhere and my husband have to give his name, they always spell Lloyd wrong. Yeah, they cannot spell they it. They spell it L-O-R-D like <clears throat> Lord, or they spell loyal or whatever, and it's L-L-O-Y-D, Lloyd. Okay, so the young lady in there, he asked, he told her his, she, he told her his name, and he said, okay, how did you spell it? She said L-L-Y-O-D, okay? All right, so whatever. So before we got our food, there were other people in ahead of us. So this one person, she called his name Ben or something like that. And then the next person she called, <laughs> Big <Ben> Sexer. <laughs> that was so funny. I was like, what? And then girl, he did a dance up there at the, 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 <laughs> at the counter and everything. And he's like, is this Big Sexy order? I'm like, what? My mom said, I'm still it. They can't misspell that. I'm like, oh my God. But anyway, y'all, we got our food. I'm gonna show you guys what it is that we got. She can show you why I'm eating. <laughs> Cause we got the same thing. So I'm gonna show you guys what we got. See? He it's hungry. Gone. He's hungry. So 
tell you guys, we're gonna eat our food and we're gonna get back on the road. We decided that we're gonna go to Moore's Feed. You all know that have been watching us for a while, know that that's my husband's favorite place to go. So we're gonna go there and we will see you guys when we get there. is more than just a feed store. They also have clothes, they have tools, they have just about everything that you would basically need in one store. It's like a one-stop shop. A lady at work told me about this product here. She says she loves it, it really gets rid of bad odors in your home. just saw we're out of moors but my husband he went to look at something else i really couldn't stay in there too too long because of the chemicals and stuff like within the feed and all the other products that they have in there they do have like chemicals to kill your grass kill weeds and what they spray on crops or whatever and that is very strong and it really is all over the store the scent the smell of it but anyway as you all can see moors is not a one complete stop shop because they don't sell food, but everything else. They even have pets in the store, uh, clothing. As you saw, I, I did a scan of some tires. Anything that you would need, like especially if you're working on a farm. They have it here. Auto parts, plumbing, what have you. They have everything. It's like this is, in this area, their Home Depot or Lowe's because they have just about everything. When I say everything, they have everything. They have uh, furniture, they have uh, things to decorate your your yard outside. Um, a lot of things, y'all. There's so much in that store, I didn't even go all the way through the store. It's just that big. So I've uh, videoed in there before. So I did this for my new subscribers, y'all. I love y'all so much. Even my returning subscribers, welcome y'all. I didn't welcome you guys in the beginning but welcome 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 to another vlog so you guys i hope you're enjoying this vlog and please say a prayer for the people that were or people or person that was in that accident the way how bad it is it didn't look like anybody survived that y'all i don't see how anybody would have survived an accident like that it, it looked like it was only one vehicle we didn't see another one unless there was another one that caused the accident and left the scene i don't know but you guys say a prayer for them and also their families because I don't know if anybody survived it. If they did, it is a miracle, a miracle from God. But anyway, I'm not going to continue to ramble on you guys. Not sure what else we're going to get into today, but whatever it is, we're going to bring you guys along with us.
can see we've made it back home. It's been a while since I did a grocery haul. When I shot with my husband, sometimes he get things that I don't get a chance to film. So what I'm gonna do now is show you all what we got at Kroger's. Okay, so for tonight's dinner, we're having burgers. So we got ground turkey. Now this is for my salad. We got some black olives, a head of lettuce, ketchup, tomato. Now my husband loves spaghetti squash. We got spaghetti squash, burger buns, a bag of my favorite salad, which is the chopped Caesar salad, and some bananas. So that is my mini grocery haul. Well, not mini, my tiny grocery haul. <laughs> oh, and I forgot to mention, you guys, my husband got a case, an 18-pack of Gatorade. Look, you guys, look who's cooking dinner tonight. As I mentioned that we're having burgers, and baby girl is making burgers for us tonight. I can't wait to see what they taste like because she really can season meat, y'all. When I say we ask her to season our chicken or season anything, when I say she seasons stuff really well, nothing is ever too salty or bland or anything. She really can season meat very well. So I can't wait to see what the burgers taste like, baby girl. <laughs> Well, you guys, I'm going to end the video here. We're going to sit down and eat dinner. And when I say baby girl did her thing in the kitchen, she did her thing in the kitchen. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And we'll see you guys in our next video.